Hey everybody, welcome to the World War G YouTube page. Ready to blank off? So, uh, we are now fully into the fall season, so you know what that means. Halloween? No. Pumpkin spice. Oh yeah. Uh, of course. Yeah. Of course. So, what we're going to do today is, this is our uh, great pumpkin spice off. And what that means is we're going to try a bunch of different pumpkin spice items and then judge them accordingly. Oh, but we've got a perfect way to judge them. We do, but first, we should probably get in the mood, right? Yeah. We're going to be trying, you know, pumpkin spice. All these spice white chick type of deal. Yeah, so yeah. we should probably feel, you know, like white chicks. Yeah. Makes perfect sense. So we have a pumpkin spice candle here. Ooh. You know, because not only will we be tasting it, but you know, we want to smell it. And exactly. The whole ambiance thing going on here. Set that there. And then we got scarves. We can. Oh, we get. I knew exactly how to put this on, but that's sad. That that is a little sad. All right. Well, I feel a bit more uh, in the fall spirit, don't you? I I do as well. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. To judge these items, we have developed a very sophisticated system. This is our pumpkin spice-o-meter. Uh, we spent many hours, oh, countless, weeks, you know, putting together algorithms, mathematical equations. This Having is, to make it, you know, crunching the numbers. Mm -hmm. This is currently being used by NASA. Uh, and each category is going to be judged in these three separate groups. First one, go ahead. How pumpkin spice is it? From not very to very. Next one, how well does it gel? How well do those flavors kind of go together? With that particular item. Right. It's going to be yes well, no well, or no well. And then our very last one, how white chick is it? From Emma Watson to all the way clear down to here. Paris Hilton. So your typical white chick that would enjoy such thing. We're all about stereotypes here at World War II. <laughs> you can see I have our little coffee cup here. Yeah. Put that there in the middle. All right. So I guess it's time to bring out our first item. So round one, we have these special K, right? This pumpkin spice special K cereal. Now it, it looks like um, frosted flakes. Yeah, frosted flakes, but like on steroids. Yeah, roid flakes, if you will. And so I'm gonna smell them first. Mm. They smell very pumpkin spicy. Really, I'm not getting a lot of pumpkin spice. Yeah, it's mm. Mm. a little bit. All right. Well now. That's hard to chew. No milk. That's rough. <laughs> That's rough. Very pumpkin spice as far as the flavor goes, though. Yeah. Sweet. I don't know what these little... Get, I don't know. They're like yogurt? I don't know what these what little they? crunchy things are. No, they have like those little teeny... Covered pumpkin spice. I don't know. That could be yogurt. I don't know. So, all right. Now we try the item. Let's bring out the board. Let's bring out the pumpkin spice meter. Okay. So how pumpkin spice is it? Personally, I'm thinking. Yeah, I'm thinking it's it's not it's, extremely. Yeah, it's subtle. Which it is, is subtle, nice. which is nice. Um, yeah, I'm thinking, yeah, probably. Right, why where you have it there? Right here? Mm hmm Yeah. All right. So then how well does it gel? Oh, uh, I would say definitely. No argument here. Yes, well. That goes really well as far as cereal goes. So how white chick is it? Now, it is Special K. Right. Reduced so fat. You're reduced right there. fat. Yeah. So that's going to bring it up a little bit. Oh, that already bumps it up to halfway in my book. Um... <laughs> But cereal, I mean, I guess if you have like skim milk with it, <laughs> that 
or true. or That's almond true. milk. <laughs> That's true. I don't know. Maybe it, I'm. Th- I, I'd make a good case to say it's a little bit more towards Paris Hilton. You think so? Yeah. True. Bump it up about right there. Only because it's like it's special K, so you're not gonna, you know, it's easy. A moment on the lips, a lifetime on the hips. You know, mm. it's not gonna be not okay. in this case. Not in this case. So now we have to determine how many white chicks it gets. Let's just punch the numbers again. So let's see. One on that. Yes. One on that. One on that girl. Oh man, I'm really digging the red hair, glasses, and Batman. Batman shirt. Batman shirt. And then that's two, right? It is. Woo! Special that was, K. That was a heavy hitter. Coming out strong with four white chicks. All right. So we're going to clear the board and move on to round two. Round two. Round two. We have a fruit pie, but it's pumpkin. So a pumpkin it's... pie? Hey. <laughs> and yeah, usually these have like strawberry or raspberry or Custard. I mean, they have all sorts of different kinds of things in it. Yeah. But it, it's glazed, which I appreciate. Yeah. I appreciate the glaze. It might help me choke this down, honestly. Alright. The filling's really cold. Yeah. That doesn't help it. This one well, you might need a toaster. Put it in the toaster? I mean, oh, like a microwave or something? Yeah, just toast it a little bit. I kind of like it. I kind of like it that way. Although I'm thinking because it's kind of crumbly, that's going to affect where it is on the bottom. Well, it, yeah, it's really crumbly and it, it's really sweet. Mm-hmm. It's like almost eating like a pumpkin infused donut type thing. Mm-hmm. Wow, a stale donut. A stale donut. All right, so let's bring the beater out. By the way, that arm you're seeing grabbing the items is our lovely assistant, Vanna. Thank you. And in case there is a tiebreaker, she'll be our official white chick. Yes, she is our resident white chick, so she'll help us out. Okay. So that was pumpkin spice, is it? That was pretty dang Bring it up. Bring it away. Yeah. Seriously. What are you Here's, like... I don't even know. Well, maybe a little. A little maybe just. Yeah, yeah okay. Alright. All right. Yeah, it's that filling. Not. So, I mean, it helped that there was, like, the outside that kind of. But that. There was a lot of glaze on that, yes. too, that added to the sweetness. Just so much pumpkin filling. How well does it gel? Mm. It's really. Mm, it's really sweet. Yeah. It's really sweet. I don't know if pumpkin goes. I don't think pumpkin is being sweet, you know? I, I was like. Expecting kind of like a pumpkin pie where it's like not so pumpkiny, mm. you still get other flavors. Yeah. So we're we thinking, yeah, no well. And then, it's, see, it's it's probably not that healthy for you, first of all. Yeah, yeah. And there's a lot of it. Sugar. I can't sugar. imagine, you know, just someone like this. <laughs> Eating a couple of those. Eating a couple of those. So I'm thinking it's kind as of well as it's kind of messy. Yeah, it's kind of it's gonna be down a lot of ways. I think. Yeah. All right. All right. How many white cheeks does it get? <clears throat> Let's see. Boom. Uh, three. Two. Uh, I think that's it. I think that's it. I think that's it. Grand total of two. Round two and two. All right. Round three. Round three. Fight. Um, We're going back to breakfast, I guess. Kind of. Yeah. These are Nutri-Grain bars. Pumpkin spice. Now, I enjoy enjoy me a a strawberry Nutri-Grain bar. Or blueberry. They're delicious. They're really good. Um, It's convenient. It is. It has a very convenient size. You grab and go. Grab and go. Uh, the filling looks exactly like that other one. <laughs> mm. For, and 
you know, just looking at this filling, it's it's very unappetizing. It is it's brown. That's why they disguised it. I mean, they put it in the center. They're trying to hide it. Hmm. Surprisingly better than I expected. It's not bad. Not not very pumpkin-y, I'll tell you that. Yeah. Well, I think because it's got so much everything else, like the um, oatmeal mm -hmm. and other things in it. Hmm. I can eat these. Be part of your well-balanced breakfast. So, I do Nutrigrain bars. How well does it pumpkin? How pumpkin spice is it? Excuse me. I'm not much, honestly. I mean, really? It's it was maybe just it was more than a cereal. That's true. So maybe almost in the middle. Yeah. About right there. I think we both agree on how well does it, Joe? Absolutely. Yes, well. And how white chick is it? Healthy. Thing, yeah. Convenient right, size. Convenient. We know white chicks love a convenient size. <laughs> um, what are we thinking? Yeah, right in here. Yeah, right in there. So wait, is this just over half, or is that what you're saying? Or yeah, you... yeah, I'd say just about okay. over half. Yeah. Okay. All right. So Nutrigrain bars. How many white chicks are we giving it? A duck face. Mm-hmm. Definitely. Classic white chick move, the duck face. An emo chick. Emo chick? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Instagram filter? Mm -hmm. Of course. Oh, okay. Absolutely. And. Bam. Ooh, the redhead. So, four on the white chick scale. That's pretty good. It is. Alright, let's move on to round four. Round four. I think it's time to cleanse the palate. Yeah, we've had all these um, heavier hitter. I'm yeah. they're like, I don't know what to call it. Food. Food. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so let's try to counterbalance it with a little, uh, little liquid. Some thick eggnog. Mm -hmm. Thick pumpkin spice eggnog. We get some nice rings here. Mm. Good gear, I think. Yeah, it does. It's still got that eggnog smell to yeah. it. Yeah, I'm not smelling much pumpkin. No. So, which is like, I don't know, I'm kind of excited about that a little bit. Mm -hmm. Let's clink it. And Over the it. lips. How's it go? Over the lips. Pass the gums. Look out, stomach, here it comes. Wow, that is not much pumpkin at all. No. At all. Like, like none. I typically have to like dilute the, I mean dilute ah. eggnog with some like milk, but Whew. actually it's not too bad. Now, I like eggnog. That's the thing. Same here. And the fact that it's not very pumpkiny actually bodes well for me. So let's bust out the meter. All right. As far as pumpkin spice. How pumpkin goes. spice is it? I think that's as low as it can go. There's no pumpkin in there, yeah. honestly. Yeah. Bold and great. But. Yes, well? What? My case for it is. Wait, why? There's no pumpkin flavor in it, hardly. Hardly. So, there, was, there was a little bit. So, as far as like. I think if it would have had too much or even a little bit more, it would have almost like thrown it off. And then how white chick is it? It's it's, it's, it's thick eggnog. It's thick eggnog. Yeah. I'm not thinking. Yeah, thing is closer to Emma. Yeah. <laughs> so how many how many white chicks are we given pumpkin mm. spice eggnog? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah. One. That's that's the legit. You get one eggnog. Are you proud of yourself? Are you happy now? Round five? Round five. Now, I love a good Keebler cookie. Who doesn't? The fudge stripe ones are delicious. And that's what these are except, of course, pumpkin. Is it white chocolate then? 
like the cookie itself, yeah. I'm thinking the cookie itself is made with pumpkin spice. Because it looks like ground, like everything mm. else, you know? Yeah. Alright. Mm. Those elves sure know how to make a good cookie. Yeah, they do. It's kind of like a gingerbread cookie almost. Yeah, it does. And frosting. That's, um, that's delightful. It is. That's really good. Mmm. Now a whole lot of, I'm just going to go ahead and finish that. That was that good. Now a whole lot of pumpkin, a little bit, not overwhelming. Pleasing on the palate. Hmm. All right. Right in here? Hmm. Maybe. Yeah, that's about right there. I think if it doesn't have much, I mean it has more cinnamon than it does yeah. pumpkin. Like you said, it tastes like a, a ginger snap. Mm-hmm. I think we can both agree. Absolutely. And then how white chick is it? I mean, they're cookies. Yeah. So I mean But at the same time, like it was it was like a nice portion size. That's true. You know. That's true. But um it's still cookies. <laughs> it's still cookies. So maybe maybe they're Yeah. They're indulging. It's the weekend, mm. you know, you've been working hard. That's true. It comes in those packages like Oreos where you just sit there and and, and eat them while you're watching. You don't realize how many. Girls. You, yeah. Know. And you don't realize how many you've eaten. Yeah. And then you hate yourself afterwards. All right. So how many white chicks does it get? Okay. Well. White chicks. Dope. Not a whole lot for the keeper cookies. Round six. All right. Round six. Now, I love a good, let's say, Kit Kat. Yeah. I love a good, uh, um, what are those called? Nutter Butters? Yeah. Wafer and chocolate. Very delicious. Wafer. These pumpkin spice wafer things. These came in a very generic package, by the way. Nothing special about no, it. Not even special. a picture of a pumpkin on it. I don't know. Was there? No. I don't know. But the, I mean, you know, it's a wafer cookie. What are you gonna do? It's unpleasant to, to chew. Cardboard. It's cardboard. It is. They put like layers of cardboard. And that pumpkin. That's the worst. That's a. That's pumpkin. a weird pumpkin. That's a pumpkin that's gone over. That's a spoiled pumpkin. Mm. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Ooh. That was not good. That 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 that's a problem is what that, that is. Yeah. From start to finish. Like holy cow, I'm gonna be tasting that for a while. <laughs> okay, how pumpkin spice is it? Mm, I mean there was some in it. Yeah, I mean but not really. Is it, that's the thing, it doesn't taste pumpkin spice, it tastes a weird else. pumpkin something. Yeah. Yeah. Ew. No well, well. does it gel? No well at all. Exactly. Gross. How white chick is it? I mean, it's, it's, there's not much to it. Yeah. I don't think you would feel bad about eating a bunch of them. Yeah. Probably not. I don't think they're going to be doing much to your diet. And you get a little bit of sweetness in there. So I'm making the case it's actually... What? No, I don't know about that. We'll make your case. That, that's the only problem. Is, is You've got a solid case there, but at the same time... I just, well, maybe it's more... I feel bad for the white chicks that would be eating these. Well, okay. Well, then should we put it in the middle then? Yeah. Yeah. So that way it would get... How many white chicks are going to get? Any? Do we want to give it an A? Should we at least give a one just to make it feel good? Make the cookie feel good? One emo. One emo. There you go. One emo chick for the wafer cookie. Round seven. Um, I don't think I'm going to want to eat any more pumpkin spice after this. Especially after that wafer. Yeah. Like it's still, like just the throat's just coated with pumpkin nasty. I'm not a big fan of yogurt. I am a very big fan of yogurt. I don't eat I like, yogurt. I like 
I don't particularly like yogurt. So let's eat some yogurt. Pumpkin spice yogurt, What's of course. What's wrong with yogurt? It's, there are live things. You're eating live things. Cultures. That's the best to hang up. And the, the taste, smell, texture, general overall being. Oh, okay. I remember now I don't eat yogurt. I'm actually digging it. It's pretty dang good. Well, I'm going to get Greek yogurt. <laughs> not really. And what are those crunchy things? I don't know. Well, they came in this like convenient pack. Pumpkin Harvest Crisp. Pumpkin Harvest Crisp. It's Chobani. Chobani? Mm. Yeah. Ugh. There wasn't too much pumpkin spice it's, to it, though. It's, are all yogurts tangy like that? No. It's tangy. That's because it's a Greek yogurt. But it's got... Is all Greek yogurt tangy? For the most part. So how pumpkin spice is it? Not much. Not much. There wasn't too much to it, yeah. I didn't taste any pumpkin, personally. Really? Mm -mm. I mean, it tastes a little cinnamon. Oil. Maybe a little, like, uh, like aftertaste. Mm -hmm. But that's it. Come on there. All right. I personally, I don't know, I think it, it went, it, <laughs> I think it went, I, I think it was alright, plus, look, I'm, I'm going by my bias here because I don't like yogurt. As far as yogurts go, though, it wasn't a bad, it wasn't a bad one. We can, we can leave them both up. Alright. Yeah, we'll leave them both up. That's going to take white. longer for them to calculate the number, crunch the numbers, but... How white chick is it? Greek yogurt. It comes in this, like, a very, very mm -hmm. convenient container, because mm -hmm. they love, like, sprinkling stuff into it. You know, mm -hmm. Who doesn't? Who doesn't enjoy that? I love me, like, some, like, snack packs, or whatever. Mm -hmm. As well as, like, calorie-wise, like... Probably not much. Not much at all. So I put it all the way up. Yeah. Paris Hilton, mm -hmm. probably sees every morning. So how many white chicks are we giving it? Let's see. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Nine. Got the Instagram filter, the duck face, mm -hmm. the cheerleader, cheerleader. Oh, and and AJ's favorite. <laughs> so a solid four for the Greek. Yogurt, pumpkin spice, yogurt, tangy. So tangy. far, we've had four. I mean, no, three. Three. We've gotten four. four yep. Yeah. All right. Final round. Round eight. Our final round. Now these are these were lovingly prepared by our assistant. Is that the secret ingredient in them? That's right. Yeah. Just like just like a, what an hour ago, something like that. Fresh out the oven. Yeah. These are fresh. Pumpkin spice. The whole house kind of smells of pumpkin spice. Muffins. Mmm. Yes. With a little uh, caramel drizzle. Ooh, nice. Just for that little extra something. Mmm. That's mm. actually really, really good. Yeah, spot on. That's fantastic. That is really good. Not too much pumpkins mm -hmm. in it. There's a little texture there, a little like crunchy texture. Yeah, I, I appreciate. It's that top shell there, which is kind of crunchy. Mmm, that glaze is delicious. Yeah. Mmm. That's tasty. It's steamy, it's steamy. All right. Let's bust out the pumpkin meter. All right. So how pumpkin spice is it? It was. It was there. I mean, it was there. You yeah, can definitely taste there. it. Yep. Does how well does it gel? Oh, fantastic! Yes, well. well. Yeah, very well. Very good and much well. How white chicks is it? I mean, it's a muffin. It is. So that yeah, gets true. a little that gets a little yeah. point there. Um, as well as it, it didn't seem like it was like heavy or anything, mm -hmm. you know, and it seems healthier. Yeah. It almost kind of reminded me a little bit of like a carrot cake. Yeah. A little bit. 
something you could grab and take on the way to the office or something. Exactly. Like New York is cappuccino. Mm. <laughs> or make them with your besties on a sleepover. Oh, there you go. So... Why haven't we made them, Troy? We haven't had a sleepover. Oh, that's true. Why that. would we let us have a sleepover? <laughs> what are you thinking? Um, Ready about there? Right there? Going there? Yeah. Alright. Oh, man. How many white chicks were given it? Homemade pumpkin spice muffins. I think they were delicious. Like this. Give you some space. You want to cause a cat fight. Yeah. I think so. Just because it was made with TLC. Yeah. And it, it was just, they were just good, right? Who knew Probably. that we were, like this, we were saving the best for last? Yeah. Best thing we've eaten is definitely those muffins. Wow, they were good. So I would say we have our champion, right? Absolutely. The homemade pumpkin spice muffins made with love. Oh. Our page, subscribe to it. Uh, comment on it if you would like. What's your favorite pumpkin spice treat? Yeah. There's still so many out there. Mm -hmm. uh, share with everybody you know. We definitely appreciate it. Um, other than that, that has been AJ. And that has been Troy. We'll see you later.